All right, students, we are looking at woodland forests, rainforests, and grasslands, three different types of habitats. The first thing we're going to do when you open up your Google Slides, you'll be able to do the same thing, but you can watch on the video here is we're going to watch this video called Types of Habitats. Let's do that right now. of rain, like a rainforest. So that video gave us a lot of information about different types of habitat. When you open up your Google Slides, you're going to go to the next page after you have watched the video. You could pause right now to watch it again to make sure that everything stays locked in your brain. And then think about the video while you answer this first question here in the middle of the page. Complete the table by listing animals that live in each habitat. So we have a rainforest, a woodland forest, a prairie, and a savanna. You may want to stop this video and go back and watch again. Make sure that you get some examples of animals for each of these, a rainforest, a woodland forest, a prairie, and a savanna. And then finally, you're going to fill in this blank here. Prairies and savannas are two different types of, and it should be a word that you are very familiar with. Next, you're going to go on and you're going to do a reading. I'm going to read it now for those of you that like to enjoy a read aloud. You can also pause and read this to yourselves. Living things in habitats. Woodland forest. Woodland forests have many trees. The fruits and nuts of the trees are perfect food for the animals that live there. There are also places for the animals to build shelter. There are many big animals in woodland forests. Bear, foxes, and deer live here. There are also smaller animals like raccoons and rabbits. Birds, insects, and worms live here too. And here we see a picture, three different pictures. We see a mama and a baby deer. We see a raccoon down there. And then we see a fox that looks like it is chasing a rabbit. Those are all examples of animals living in the woodland forest habitat. Let's keep going. Now let's learn about a rainforest. A rainforest is, a hot, is hot and damp. It rains almost every day. The climate here helps many living things grow. Many kinds of plants and animals live in the rainforest. Jaguars, Red-eyed tree frogs, toucan, and sloths are some of the interesting rainforest animals. So now we're getting into some really interesting exotic animals. You see this bird here, that's a toucan with the big beak. And then we see a leopard, a lot of people's favorite animal with all of those nice beautiful spots. And down here at the bottom, a red-eyed tree frog. Look at those big, bright red eyes. That's the same kind of frog 
That's the one that we have at the front of the school, 13th Avenue by the lobby. Let's read about grasslands. Grasslands are wide areas. They are filled with low growing plants, such as grasses and wildflowers. There isn't enough rain, <coughs> excuse me. There isn't enough rain to grow tall trees. There is enough rain that it is not a desert. I'll say that again. There is enough rain that it is not a desert. In North America, the grasslands are called prairies. Bison and prairie dogs, as well as birds and insects live here. In the African savanna grassland, you will find zebras, elephants, and lions. <coughs> so these big animals here, those are bison, similar to the American buffalo. That's another name for it. Then we see some elephants and some, is that a lion down there at the bottom? Okay, so you may, might want to pause, reread that to yourself, or replay it with me reading it to you. And then finally, you're going to answer just these last questions at the end here. This habitat is hot and dry with lots of room to roam. It is a blank. Number four, this habitat has lots of trees that provide fruit and nuts for its animals. It is a blank. And our last question, the habitat is hot and damp with many bright green plants. So go back and fill in the answers. You might wanna look at how we spell grasslands, rainforest, and woodland forest, and fill in those answers to the correct description. And that is it. So take your time, reread it to yourself, or rewatch the video. I look forward to seeing how you do. You are all doing great. Don't forget to hit turn in. Thank you.